Hey everyone, this is Jason, and in this Tech Tips video, I'm going to be talking about the differences between our newer style of barrel hubs as compared to our traditional style of clamping hubs. To illustrate the differences between these two styles of hubs, we've put together this little demonstration rig. You can see here on the right that I have a standard style of clamping hub, and this is a quarter inch D bore. And on your left, I also have a quarter inch D bore hub, but this one is the barrel style. Now these are both utilizing the 770 pattern for mounting. The primary difference is the style with which they clamp. You can see that the standard clamping hub, it's much more compact. So if space is at a premium in your build, that's going to be a good option. Whereas the, the barrel hub is a heavier duty hub. So it's longer axially, which provides stability and it is thicker and stronger all around. But the other cool feature is that it is totally balanced. So being completely symmetrical gives you the ability to spin up to really high speeds and not introduce vibration into your project. The gear motor that I have on this assembly can spin up to over 1600 RPM, but I'm overdriving that just a bit, about two and a half times to output about 4,000 RPM to these two shafts. We're gonna do one at a time and see the difference. Now, it's important to note that 1600 RPM is pretty fast, but it's not a fast enough speed to really make a noticeable difference between these two hubs because these standard clamping hubs, although they're not balanced, they're gonna work for most applications. So I really had to get it up pretty fast here to illustrate this point. So this is what it looks like at uh, over 4,000 RPM. You can see it's dancing around a little bit. You can see the vibration. You can hear the vibration that's happening. Now let's go ahead and see what that looks like with the barrel hub. As you can see, it is much, much smoother with the barrel hub. So in summary, the barrel hub is going to be a heavier duty and more balanced hub that are great for high speed applications. And the standard clamping hub is great for applications that don't have an incredibly high speed and especially in situations where space is at a premium. As always, if you have any questions, send us an email to tech at servocity.com.